What's up guys, I'm Vern. I'm Hunter. Welcome to another edition of Pokeboy Production Channel. Another unboxing. You ready, Hunter? Yeah. And you already know, you kind of know what's inside because oh. it says it right there. <laughs> <laughs> what we have today is the Hollow... Hollow Fan? Hollow Fan. What is this? I know it's a fan, but what do you mean by Hollow Fan? <laughs> You'll see. So keep watching. Alright, Hunter. Let's see what this holo fan is all about. Is it holo or hollow? Uh, holo. I think it's halo. Halo. halo? Oh, holo. 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 Uh, kind of uh, kind of gives you an idea what it is, right? Uh, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I'm just gonna go with it. Go with the flow. This is not a Kickstarter. This is something I saw on Facebook. Facebook's been snooping on me and decided that I want to buy it. Right. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> It's the algorithm. Yeah, the algorithm caught me, you know. Okay, that was pretty simple. Yeah. Okay. Fancy, look at the picture. <laughs> so he's definitely a fan. Some mm -hmm. kind of fan. Some kind of a fan. Uh, let's see. I would... Uh, uh, well, it's in Chinese, but... <laughs> I guess you could play music in here. There's Wi-Fi. I don't know what that is. And Android and iOS or Apple com compatible. I think that's like some kind of warranty, whatever it is. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's in Chinese. Holofan, <laughs> so. here, Vern. It's a thank you card to you for buying them because they, you, they found you in the algorithm. <laughs> thank you for your support. So that's why it is Holo. YOLO fan. Ooh, look at this. Yeah. Looks fancy. Fancy. Well, I do see... Okay. Here's my best guess. In the fan, right, I see LEDs. Meaning that probably we could have, you know, as this thing turns, you could probably see, like, words or pictures or anything that the LED can produce. Is that correct, Ron? That is correct. So uh -huh. you could play it. I heard you could play movies on it, so I don't know. Oh no, it's cracked. I should uh. And then here's another crack. Yeah. That's how it came in, okay. okay. I'm gonna have to break them. Yeah, it's uh, shipping. Uh, it's not Brent's fault. Brent didn't do anything since you could see we're still unboxing this thing. <laughs> uh, here goes one part of the stem. It's a piece. Here's another part of the stem. Okay. The charger. Okay. Uh, instruction manual. Right? Instruction manual. <coughs> and last but not least, okay, I'm supposed to take this out. The base. Base in your face. All right. Looks simple enough. Yeah. It's, not, it's pretty good. I don't think there's any batteries to this, so we just have to plug this in. Right. Most probably it's, it's a type type C. Uh, I do charger. see the I do see the type C in there. Yeah. So maybe it does. You maybe if it's charged enough, you don't even need this brick. But it'd be nice. Let's see what happens. All right. Um, that's all that came in the box, right? Yes, sir. It's pretty straightforward. Um, yeah, I don't like the crack. <laughs> I'm gonna have to write them. But I don't think it's gonna. I don't think it's going to do anything with the, it's not, it's like cracked it's inside, inside the, it's not yeah. outside, so. Yeah, it's not, it's not going to. Unless you're really looking at it, but I don't think you're going to be. I think there were two options for this. You could have it, one with the glass, one without the glass. So I got one with the glass just in case kids would put their hands in there or something. You know, you know kids, very mm -hmm. inquisitive, so I kept the glass on. But. Hmm, here's what my observation is, Vern. They call it the hollow fan. This is not an electric fan that blows wind on you. Yeah, yeah. It's not, right? No. It's just for display. Display purposes, yeah. Okay. Yeah, because there's a hole here for, I guess, for the exhaust of it, for mm -hmm. the heat of the, um, the LEDs and all the mecha mechanisms inside. But this is not the type of fan that will, you know, provide air, air or there. wind into, in your face, even though, you know. But if I took out the glass, that would still not work, right? No, it won't because the um, the flap are flat. It doesn't have that bend that oh, would gotcha. give you the right, right. 
the air. So right. yeah, so this is for uh, just uh, the play, display, display purposes. Display purposes. Right. Interesting. Interesting indeed. All right. So we're gonna play around with it. We'll be right back. All right. So uh, Henry put it together. I'll show you how it. It's, it's pretty simple. I showed on the screen where Henry did. It. Simple uh, attachments, right, Henry? Mm-hmm. It's just two stems. And <laughs> That's, That's it. it. All right. So we're gonna turn this on. There it is. So you could kind of see it from the back. I could see it. Yeah. It says hollow fan. That's pretty cool. I can't. I see it, but you know, <laughs> through the. It's probably gonna look better at night, right? Definitely. When you have no light. You can turn it around so you can see it kind of, if you want. Cool. It's 3D. <laughs> 3D. All right. Let me um download the app. Give me one second. So I couldn't find the app on the Google Store, so this is what the company sent me. This is an actual app on a Windows machine. It's not very intuitive, but if you follow through their email, they'll step you through on how you can download videos and get this fan working, hopefully. So here's the hollow fan. Hannah and I couldn't find the Wi-Fi name and the app. So, the next best thing was I had to email the company, figure out what the hell is going on because I can't connect to this. And they gave me the option of downloading it through my PC, um, taking out the memory card, which is here, I believe, in the back, where you could just pop it out. And then download a zip file, wired it in, and encode a couple of videos and then upload it into the fan and that's the quick workaround I guess it's better than just trying to send this over back to them I don't know how much that's gonna cost with the size of this fan so let's see what happens alright so I was able to squeeze that micro SD card through this hole if you're able to get it out it's pretty hard to take out with your fingers, especially if you have stubby fingers like me, look at that, it's like no room at all. And you have to kind of spin the fan, squeeze in there and push it to get it out. Same thing as pushing it back in. So it's a little tough. So if you're to get this fan, make sure you get the one without the clear plastic case. It'll be easier for you in the long run to get this mini card out of here. Anyway, let's see if it works. I'm going to test it out. I hope you guys enjoyed that um, as you can see there is no sounds and whatever you see is what you get so insert sounds as you see fit and you can see the animation with the camera you can see the frames per second so it's not ideal but seeing it in um, person you could actually see the animation so it's pretty good <coughs> but um, like I said um, I wish there was a Wi-Fi and an app because this becomes cumbersome. You can't just carry this around with you and just download the Wi-Fi with the app and connect your phone here. There is a connection in the back for your Type-C. So that's rendered useless. I guess the company saves money or saves you money by sending this big contraption over to them. Shipping charges will probably be expensive so I can see why. 
But yeah, as a workaround, it's pretty good. If you have a computer, just connect it, download whatever video you want, and put it on. I mean, it's pretty cool, but like I said, I wanted the portability, and that's not there. So anyway, guys, final thoughts coming up. Well, Hunter, what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to email uh, support from HoloFan because it's supposedly uh, connected with your phone to Wi-Fi, but we couldn't find the actual, what's it called? 3D something the something. The network, the, the network. SSID of the, this thing. And there's no buttons in the back for us to turn, to make sure to turn it on or off if the Wi-Fi is on and off. There's no buttons or anything. So there, there's no indication that this thing is, you know, Wi-Fi is on. Yeah, so I'm going to have to email their support group. There's an email here. So I'm going to have to uh, find out what's going on. Maybe even inquire about the cracked glass. It's not even glass, it's like plastic. Yeah, the acrylic glass. Yeah. So uh, acrylic plastic. see what they say. But for now, I'm disappointed. <laughs> I'll be wah, looking. Wah, wah. <laughs> At least this solo fan spinning thing looks cool, but... <laughs> It's loud. It's loud. I was looking forward to putting some images on there. Yeah. Maybe some movies or cartoons or videos or whatever. But for now, thumbs down like Henner says. Sorry Holo fan, until you can get this fixed for us, I'm not gonna give you a good review. Uh, send you an email, hopefully you could help us. So uh, yeah, sorry guys. That's, the, that's what happens when you buy things. Sometimes you're, you get the bad end of the stick, right Henner? <laughs> <laughs> yes, definitely. This is a bad end of a stick. <laughs> so, hopefully you could fix it, rectify it. Uh, we'll fo do a follow-up video if I hear something from them. But otherwise, yeah, try our best. So, didn't work out of the box. <laughs> so, Henner, last words. Yes, please don't forget to comment, subscribe, and hit that bell button. Ding, ding, ding. See you guys. <laughs>